So three races from Crunchy will finish the week off for me then. And we start off with the two mile three foot on 0 to 80 handicap. And at the top we've got Archduke for Craig Beckwith, David Coverdale, Martin Lidham, Tammy Ninnis, Stu Gray, Immortality, Satyam made fantastic, Thomas Rogers, Late Night, and Little Port and Brandy for Martin Kins, Tikiti Namika for Alex Cherry, and James Shane's got the bottom pair, Alan Mo Riva and Aunt Polly. So ten of them then on the turf this time I think yes they are and ready to go and away they go in closest to us Immortality and right over on the far side of the grey on the rail is Tammy Ninnis but it's looking like Immortality is going to get the early lead pulling for its head and pulls quickly two or three clear of the rest of them are in a bit of a heap at this point sorting themselves out late night just about the back marker but it's Immortality who's got the lead by about Three and a half to four lengths. Little Port and Brandy's moved through to second. The grey Tammy Ninnis is on the inside in third. Then comes Archduke with Almo Reaver after that one. David Coverdale in the maroon jacket on the outside is next. Then Aunt Polly and Takiti Namika. And finally late night at the back. But the leader, Immortality, is now full of clear. They won't want to let this one get too far in front. But it'll probably stay there if they do. And Almo Reaver has moved through in a second, David Coverdale and Tammy in his third and fourth then Archduke and Little Port and Brandy made fantastic and Aunt Polly and finally late night and Tamiki Nakika or even Takiti Namika so <laughs> it's Immortality then who leads by five lengths to Alamo River in the second Tammy in his the grey third David Coverdale fourth and Archduke after that one Made fantastic is next. Little Port and Brandy after that one. And then late night to Kitty Namika and finally Aunt Polly. So they've got a mile and a half still to go. And Immortality is in the lead by four. To Alamo River in second and Tammy Ennis another length or two back in third. Then Archduke and David Cordell and made fantastic virtually three in a line with Little Port and Brandy just behind them. Then to Kitty Namika and late night. And finally, Aunt Polly just tucked in the inside at the back of the pack. But it's Immortality with a mile and a quarter to go. Leads down to three now. Alamo River is second. Tammy in his third. Archduke fourth. And David Coverdale and made fantastic to Geeti Namika. And the Martin Cairns pair together. Late night and Little Port and Brandy. And finally, Aunt Polly is still the back marker as they continue on the turn, they're virtually always on the turn and it's Immortality who continues to show the way to Alamo Riva and Tammy Ninnis Archduke is in fourth and then made fantastic, David Cornell just lost his place, then Takiti Namika then Aunt Polly Little Port and Brandy and finally Late Night as Immortality continues to show the way, leading by two to Alamo Riva second Tammy Ninnis third, made fantastic fourth, then Archduke then Takiti Namika and David Coverdale together. Just behind them, Aunt Polly starting to run on, and the Martin Cairns pair at the back late night, and Little Port and Brandy, six furlongs still to go. And Immortality's led all the way so far. Still leads by the best part of two lengths to Alamo River and Made Fantastic, who's moved through into third. Then comes Takiti Namika and Archduke. Tammy Ennis is next. Then David Coverdale gap back to Aunt Polly. Little Port and Brandy and Late Night, but nothing's out of this yet. Still got four and a half furlongs to go. Plenty of racing still to be done. And Immortality leads by two. From in second place, Alamo River and Made Fantastic. Archduke, David Coverdale now starts to run around the outside. Tammy Ennis is trying to follow, but it's Immortality that's got the lead. David Coverdale goes into overdrive with just a little more than three furlongs to go and it's Immortality three lengths clear off David Coverdale Archduke on the outside now toes past that one then comes Made Fantastic Alamo River to Keating and Mika trying to run on but Immortality has hit the gas again and he's two clear of Archduke in second Archduke are beginning to close Made Fantastic and David Coverdale not one pace is between the front two surely there's a furlong and a half to go it's Immortality and Archduke Archduke is beginning to wear him down Archduke gets up on the outside Archduke goes into the lead it's Archduke from Immortality. Archduke goes a length clear, then racing into the final half furlong. And Archduke's going to take this one, I think. Immortality's trying to fight back. Made fantastic is running on, but Archduke's going to take it. At the line, it's Archduke, the winner. Immortality is going to be second. Made fantastic third. Tikini Namika fourth. David Cordell hung on for fifth. And all the way back to Art Polly, who was the last one to finish. 
But he's had a few today. Craig Beckwith that came with late runs and didn't quite get there. This one got there easily and took it. Archduke, Immortality second, made fantastic third. Let's get a full list of the connections. It's Archduke, the winner for Craig Beckwith. Immortality second. For Satyam, made fantastic third for Thomas Rogers. Takiti Namika was fourth for Alex Cherry and David Coverdale was fifth.